All right, so in this video, you're going to learn how to solve a system of equations using both substitution and elimination. So we're going to start with substitution. And what you're going to have here is you're going to have two equations, obviously, right? That's your system of equations. And once you solve for one variable, so the first step, solve for one variable. And if one variable is already solved for, which in this case, y is solved for, y equals 2x plus 6, then you substitute 2x plus 6 for y. Or if, let's say, x equals 4y four, four plus 3, you would sub 4y plus 3 in for x in the equation. So essentially, you're substituting a variable, substituting a certain expression for a variable. So in this situation, in this problem, what how you would write it is 4x plus 2. And now to substitute for y, it's not y, it's 2x plus 6, because y equals 2x plus 6. So we can just sub it in. And now you just put equals 20, and we can solve for x. So obviously, if you distribute there and there, you're going to get 4x plus 4x plus 12 equals 20. Uh, 20, subtract 12, combine like terms, 8x equals um, 8. Divide, uh, divide by 8, obviously, x equals 1, right? So now we just solve for x. x equals 1. So now we know what one of the values is. So what do we do? We substitute what x equals into here to find what y equals, okay? So we're going to put y equals 2 times 1, because x equals 1, plus 6. And obviously, just simplify. Obviously, y equals 8. And that is your answer. So if you were to submit your answer as a coordinate pair, obviously, it would be 1, 8. Just put it in terms of x, comma, y. And that is your answer. And that is how to solve the system of equations using substitution. Now, if we move on to elimination, um, elimination is a little bit different. What you do in elimination, in this problem right here, instead of solving for one variable, what we're going to do is we're going to make this, oh, whoops, we're going to make this and this the same value, or we can make this and this the same value. Now, what that is going to do is, so let's say we want to make the x's equal. So what we're going to do is we're going to multiply the entire equation by 3. So we're going to get 3x plus, so you distribute all the way, 3x plus 12y equals, now 3 times 19, don't forget to multiply the 19 by 3. It's a common mistake equals 57. 19 times 3 is 57. 3 x plus 12 y equals 57. And now this and the 3 x below here are equal. So all we do is subtract. Obviously, 3 x minus 3 x cancels out the x's. So now we only have one variable, y. 2 y minus 12 y gives us negative 10 y. Then negative 17 minus negative 57 equals negative 40. Obviously, divide y equals 4. Now we just solved for y. And now that we have y solved, we can just use substitution and substitute 4 in for y into a different or into either of the expressions. So let's just substitute it into this expression here. So 3x plus 2 times 4, because that's what y equals, substitute it in for y equals 17. So 3x plus 8 equals 17. Subtract the 8. 3x equals 9. x equals 3. Now, if you were to put your answer in a coordinate pair, 
if that's what the answer requires, it's three, four. And that is how to solve using elimination.